kid is Game & Watch. Go, starting off at Smashville, game number one. All right, Ringo, hot start, getting two dash stacks. Down tilt, down air, tries for the early spike. You cipher to get back. Another down air, right? Oh, land the C4 on Wishful Kid, and Wishful Kid gets sent flying. All right, we'll, we'll see if uh, if some of these wishful kid able to get that up B, which comes out much too fast. <laughs> it looks like he's being able to build up some damage against Gringo in, uh, for lack of a better term, some kind of retaliation for that early stock take. Yeah. The Gringo off to off to a hot start, but right now, um, oh, gets the berry. That will take the stock. Gringo did bring Wishful Kid up to ninety percent. So we'll have to see what Wishful Kid can do. Landed C four on him again. Game and Watch a very light character, so it, again with the C four. Okay. Proving the C4 is actually a really good... Well, you know, the thing that's happening is that Peningo has been multiple times been able to just land the C4. Oh, got to... <laughs> It's just as you said it. Gringo able to land that C4 for the final KO against Wishful Kid to take round one. Yeah, unfortunately. Wish bringing in the uh, the hat Jigglypuff. Let's see if that works against the snake this time. Back here at Smashville. Oh, more of the same, at least to start off. Let's <laughs> <It> connect with <laughs> two straight C4s. <laughs> uh, the C4 meta seems to be strong. Oh my goodness! Go. That took 15 Holy. seconds! Holy crap! <laughs> Yeah, uh, Jigglypuff's weight definitely doesn't help being a light character. I mean, it was the same thing with uh, Game & Watch as well. Bo both Jiggly and Game & Watch are among the lightest characters in the game, so... They can die pretty early. Unfortunate SD there from Gringo. Might give Wishful Kid a little bit of an opening here. See, but, looks like he's trying to make use of that and get close range, but Gringo... That gets a drag down. Obviously, those aerials from Jigglypuff go out so, so, so far. Dash attack. Gets the uh, forward air to take that stock, and suddenly, Wishful Kid... Up a stock. Yeah. Oof. Nikita, oh, a little close to the C4 there. Gonna wait out the grenade to try to get closer again, since it seems to be a tactic that's working against Gringo. All right, up, oh, jumps over the uh, down smash. Sorry, forward smash. <laughs> Snake is one of the few that I can actually identify what kind of weapons he uses. All right. Attempt to try to drop a Nikita on their wishful kid real quick. Yeah. Oh, where where is he going? Oh, oh no. <laughs> oh no, unfortunate self destruct. I mean Jigglypuff has a lot of jumps, but I didn't think I don't think they have that many jumps to float underneath the stage. <laughs> Unfortunately not. Looks like Rigo's trying to bait Wishful into getting some Oops. grenade and C4 hits. Jig goes to, goes to sing and just gets hit by grenade. Back air from Gringo. Oh, dropping the C4 right next to him again. But... Morse, uh... I almost used a technical term, the mortar stonk. Still looking, uh, 
Karingo still looking for the uh, C4 to take it, but we'll get the up smash. Finalized, very close match, still very, very fast paced. See in the chat, HBox would not be proud of 